All right, so welcome back to another video. Today, we are going to be playing through a game called The Cursed Tape. This game is about a mysterious videotape that was slipped under our door, and we obviously watch it and a bunch of crazy shit happens, so let's go ahead and dive right in. All right, so it basically just throws us directly into the game. Uh, this one doesn't have a menu or settings as well, I don't think. No, it does not. I tried hitting escape and we didn't get anything popping up. So I'm assuming this is just, you know, how it is and we just have to roll with it. But I have to say, I'm not mad about it because this game does not disappoint on the uh, visual side of things. So let's just see how overwhelmingly terrifying it is. Hopefully it scares the hell out of me because it will make one great video, another great addition to this channel. And we do not have a flashlight, so I'm going to go straight for the TV because it's about a cursed tape, so why not? Okay. Not really seeing anything. L said, well, okay, there's a door over there, and there. Hello? There's a door right here as well. And like I said at the beginning of this video, um, there is a tape slipped under our door, and I'm assuming it's probably this one. This one looks like, oh, I was wrong. So we have some whistling and some very kind of distinctive demonic voices, deep demonic voices going on as well. So, you know, that's never a good sign. Oh, this is actually really cool. I love this so far and we just, we just started. So yeah, let's, uh, let's get this going. Also, please be kind and rewind. That is very important. Oh, shit. Okay, okay. Ugh. Oh, what the fuck? So he has a foot in it. Oh. Alright, he has a foot. And an ear, uh, wow, in an ear. No, I was gonna say a foot and a hand are placed where his ears should be. Oh, we're locked in. Let's cut this. Oh, we can cut the rope. Yep. I already knew before my brain did. All right. Okay. All right, so far. Dang, there's, uh, there's some brutal butchery going on down here. Shit. Uh, I was going to say my, um, my adrenaline is pretty good tonight. I'm not feeling like squeamish and, or, uh, you know, on edge, I should say as much as I was on the last video I did, which was, uh, okay guys, I totally drew a blank there. I don't know what happened, but the game I was thinking of was literally the last game I did. I played it last night. And I actually loved it. It was, uh, it happened at night. I'm so sorry about that. But, uh, yeah. Just wanted to mention that because that game had me on edge like crazy. It was really bad. Okay. Um. Oh, okay. Wait. I can I not use what I already have? No, I cannot. Okay. So it looks like we need to find an axe. And I'm pretty sure all I have is, I think, well, at first it looked like a knife, but when we peeked it, when we peeked, wow, Jesus, I'm falling apart. When I picked it up, it looked like a, a meat cleaver. So I'm pretty sure it was a meat cleaver. Oh, I could have swore I just seen something crawl across the ground right there. Wow, 
Wow, yeah, this is, uh, this is creepy as hell, though. So, okay. We're looking for an axe. That's... Oh, that's a start. I feel like I'm in hell right now. No entry, staff only. Ugh. I feel like I'm some, like, pawn in someone's sick game right now, because... I don't know, I'm getting like a Saw vibe right now. Oh, okay, alright. Weird. Of course, let's go down the creepy stairs and up the creepy stairs. Okay. Okay, okay. Alright, alright. This, uh, oh, oh, okay. Something's moving. Oh, fuck this. Oh, this isn't good. I was gonna say this uh, area does looks doesn't look stable. It looks very unstable. Oh, hello. Are you sleeping? Well, I was hoping that you would have an axe for me, but it looks like you don't. Oh shit. You think you're so funny, don't you? Alright, I think we have to go downstairs. Wait, hold on. Before I do that, I'm gonna check this out over here. Through the chains. Oh, it goes up higher. Oh, there it is. I got lucky. Maybe, possibly, we'll see. Oh, this is, I got a really bad feeling about this. Oh! Oh, no, 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 no way. You gotta be kidding me. That thing sounds huge. We are in a bad, bad situation. <laughs> oh, I kind of had a feeling there was something gonna go past there and it still fucking got me. Oh, that was good though, that was good. I love it when you expect it, but it, it's, it doesn't matter, it still gets you. Ah, oh, Jesus. Okay. Alright, so we need to make our way back the way we came, so down these stairs. Down the stairs we go. Oh! Okay, alright. Oh, okay. Can you at least let me make it to the area I need to go? I mean, I guess I could have just like skipped that and gone through the shorter area, but you know. All right. Oh, oh, I see something. I hear something. Okay, I think we're in the right spot. Yes, okay. Oh, I'm watching my back. Oh, okay. 
Let's go. Let's get the fuck out of here. Okay, all right. Guys, uh... Hello. Wooden man. Well, oh shit. I was gonna say, I have a feeling this is gonna be a really great game though. I, I love the, uh, the style of this a lot. Um, oh, there we go. I, I had to move it twice. Oh, hello. Another wooden man. Okay, all right. Cannot go up the ladder, okay. Yeah, let's follow the blood trail. That's, that's always a good plan. Interesting. Oh, all right, we're gonna go upstairs. <laughs> we're gonna go upstairs. What is that noise? Oh no. Let me in. Shit, we're fucked. Yeah, I don't really like this one bit. So that thing is gone now. Okay. Oh man, can I take this knife? Cannot, okay. Oh, thank you for the keys, sir. Are you gonna do something as soon as I take them? Oh no, oh no, oh no, I don't want to look back. I'm just going to keep going straight, keep going straight. Nope, nope, I'm ignoring you, I'm ignoring you. Oh, fuck you, you piece of shit. Clean up this trash while you're at it, you dumbass. Oh, I am in hell. Okay, so it looks like we can only go this direction. Whoa. You know what? I'm not going to lie. I feel like if hell really exists... It probably it probably looks exactly like this place. Oh, this is probably what hell would really be like. Oh shit! Oh. Okay. All right. All right. We're making our. Dude, that's not even funny. That's not cool. Hey, man, that's not cool. All right. Oh, what the f I see you right there. You go away, please. You're just a fucking thorn on my side at this point. I hear growling. It sounds like a fucking T-Rex. Okay, all right. Gates of hell, am I right? Dude, I swear to God. I swear to God, I'll fight you. Okay, it's really like pitch black over here. It's so hard to see. Really hard to see.
Okay, so... We can't go over there. And we can't go in there. Oh, here we go. Oh, wow, okay. I have to blow out the candles? Very funny. Can I take one of these knives like in a... This is probably not gonna be good. Who is it? No one's here, no one's home. There's a tongue, that is a tongue. And that's a brain, that's a, a heart. Wow, there's so many uh, pieces to the collection. Okay, all right, so... Which way to go? Oh, this way. Can't... No? Oh, don't you be playing that shit. I need my flashlight. Okay, we can't go that way. Oh! Oh, that, that one got me. Holy shit, that one got me good. Oh. Jesus, that's crazy. I don't appreciate that one bit. Left control. Dude, this guy's fucking psycho. Oh. I have a feeling we're gonna be fucked here soon. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, I see you. Would you go away? You are really, a really a huge pain in the ass. Hearing growling again. I swear, if there's a fucking T-Rex in this game, I'm gonna be so pissed. I'm gonna fucking lose it. That would be like the weirdest, most random uh, setup for a game. Oh, there you are. Okay. So we can only go in here that I know of. All right. Are you following me again? So the interesting thing is when you, um, Hold on a sec. I need to figure out something. I need to go look down there just in case I'm missing anything before I proceed in the other uh, direction. Oh, we got more whistling. Uh, what I was going to say is when you first start this game and <sighs> You know what? I totally saw something else. I literally thought someone drew a dick and balls on this, on the front of this van. <laughs> and it, it wasn't that, but that's what I saw. Um, what I was going to say is when you first start this game and you're like in your apartment and you receive the mystery tape, uh, and when you transition into this, it, they're like, there is a huge, huge difference. It's like, it feels like you're playing two completely different games. I mean, that's exactly what it feels like. So you, as you're kind of going through this, you kind of forget 
were vaguely forget um how this game started and you're like wait i was just in an apartment and now i'm like in a fucking crazy factory that reminds me of hell and uh yeah it's just a weird transition but in a really good way um obviously i'm assuming that you know uh this is like footage that we're watching uh in our apartment this isn't actually us but it's just like us watching it but we are controlling it i didn't even realize or know if i was going the right way but i just triggered something i was just kind of going around waiting to stumble upon something and uh i guess i'm in the right place oh no i hate fucking keypads okay um all right so i guess i need to go back upstairs follow this really cool looking purple light that is a cool light I'm not really used to seeing any other colors in these games other than like red you mostly see red but this is cool all right is this all just for me like wow this you went out you went through all this trouble to to set this up for me thank you like i feel honored i feel so so accepted of uh, this see this shit is cool okay this is different i love this you know what's interesting is the uh the it happened at night game uh you have a glow stick as well, which is really cool. So I hope that you see more games like this kind of doing that thing. I mean, I still love flashlights, but this is a cool touch too. Um, however, I'm very terrible at what we got going on here because <laughs> uh, I'm not that smart. Um, Okay, so UV, UV light. I'm holding that in my hands right now. And then... And then the keypad is underneath. And it's showing the keypad by the door. Okay. Okay, so we have three directions. Let's try this one. Yeah, this is really cool. Like, that's... Oh! All right, Jesus. Oh. I already feel like I'm in hell, so this, I feel like... <laughs> that is crazy. Someone's trying to drive. <laughs> I can't believe they're doing this shit to me right now. Okay. Well. <laughs> I don't really know what to make of that, but we are going to head back. Okay, so let's follow this arrow this way. So this leads to him still. Do you have anything for me, sir? No? Okay, let's head back. And uh, make our way, make our, uh, uh, can't talk today. I can never talk. <laughs> make our way back to the keypad. Okay, so we're going this direction now. Oh, that was cool. Yeah, this place is a maze though. Like it really is. Like you really have to... The sounds in this game are ridiculous. You really have to second guess yourself a lot when trying to figure out if you're going the right, right direction or not. Oh, that's a drop right there. I cannot go that way. That's cool.
Okay. Huh. Follow the blood stains. There you are. Oh, okay, so. Brain, don't fail me now, but I know you will. Okay, so I actually stumbled upon another one, which is over here, right? And then, okay, and the other one is actually right here. So there's one more that I think I need to find. All right, so I was actually wrong. We ended up finding all of the ones that we needed to find. So we got eight, two, four, nine. Eight, two, four, nine, open. There we go. And if you want to know how I came to that assumption, I mean, not assumption, but you know, I ended up using a calculator because I am terrible at math. So I don't, uh, yeah, <laughs> it's just easier for me. All right. So first off, we have some creepy dolls and creepy sounds sounds going on right now oh that's not good <laughs> this made a really weird turn I'm not gonna lie this doll is holding a skeleton arm I don't like that sound. Okay. Uh, in the corner of my eyes, I totally thought those were like a pair, like a bolt cutters, but they were just arms. They were just, what the fuck is up with this game? Weird. Oh, oh, you asshole. Look at that. Look at that smile. Oh, thank you for letting me in finally. This is weird. Um, uh, I think I'm getting gassed in. Wait, so we have three dolls at the top and spiky hair needs to go in the top shelf and then okay so I need to figure out where those dolls are okay right oh this is weird It's not these. Um, <laughs> I don't know. Like, I'm assuming they're in here somewhere. Okay, so I'm assuming they are not in here because I have been looking this place over really, really well. And I cannot come across. Wait, I didn't. Oh, my God. You got to be kidding me. I didn't, the only place I hadn't checked was behind this door. Um, spiky hair McGee goes on top, I remember. Okay, I know for a fact that I searched every, every other corner and nook and cranny in this fucking room, so it has to be out here somewhere. Oh, I don't remember you. That is fucking creepy, all right. I okay let me just tell you how lucky this find was because for some reason my eye was just already there like literally right on like the white dot and then I seen it if I hadn't seen it let me tell you I would have been looking for that for a long ass time I really would have okay so that is proof enough that there out here as well, so I just need to try and oh, oh, oh.
<laughs> oh my god. Oh my god, that literally took my breath away. <clears throat> Motherfucker. Oh, Jesus. So, uh, as I was saying, the other one has to be out here somewhere, so I need to look at every single corner. Every single fucking corner. God damn. That one got me really good. Jesus. Okay, it's not in that box either. Is it? Okay, we still can't go in this room. Oh. Nuh uh. No one's home. Ah, here it is. Yes. That's what's up. Okay. Oh, nope, nope. So we found the last one we need to find. <clears throat> We're closing that door. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. Wait, he's got something in his hand. Something I can't take, apparently. Whoa. What are- what is that? What are those? They each have- Oh, they're- they're, uh, they're camcorders. That's how they're making the tapes. There's more tapes. Whoa. Wow. Oh, uh, let me get the, I need, okay. That's gonna be the thumbnail right there. That's badass. That's fucking rad. Okay, well, what do you want me to do? Oh! This is where the fucking tape came from. Dude, that's fucking sick. And the whistling, this is, this is where it all started. Talk about a sweet pass, right? It's like, go long, here's the fucking tape, dude. Good luck. All right, guys, so that was The Cursed Tape. That game was awesome. I loved every bit of that game. Uh, and it was just a really, really creative concept. I love how it, like, as the story played out, it, like, shows that it's basically looping. But it's like, you, you find out that what you're playing through is literally you as a different character uh, leading up to like passing the tape under the door to the, you know, the other person. I don't, I don't even know if like it's the same. It's got to be two different characters, right? Because yeah, they're passing the tape under the door to the guy or to the person uh, in the apartment, which, you know, that was really cool. And I loved that you get to use a UV light to like, you know, go through and follow different blood stains and different writings on the wall to figure out the code. Like that was really cool. That was a good, good, uh, a good creative addition to this game. Uh, but anyways, I hope you all enjoy this video. Please give this video a thumbs up. Please consider subscribing for more content to come in the future. I know there's a lot of videos going to be coming out. There's a lot of games to be played through. Uh, so I cannot wait for that, but I hope to see you all next time.